Imagine a world where every choice has profound implications, not just for you, but for the entire fabric of reality. Today, I want to explore a tantalizing question. Would you be willing to sacrifice honey for the existence of the matrix? Let's dive into this philosophical conundrum. First, let's break down what we mean by sacrificing honey. It's not just about giving up that sweet, sticky substance that bees magically create. It's about saying goodbye to an entire ecosystem service provided by bees, including pollination, which is crucial for the biodiversity of our planet. Now juxtapose that with the matrix, a complex simulated reality. It's not just a sci-fi concept, but a philosophical gold mine. Would the creation of such a reality justify the loss of something as natural and essential as honey? This isn't just about taste. It's about survival versus technological supremacy. Consider the implications. On one hand, losing honey means a direct hit to our global food security, potentially leading to ecological collapse. On the other hand, the matrix could represent the pinnacle of human achievement, a new reality unbound by the physical limitations of our world. This dilemma isn't just about what we stand to gain or lose. It's a reflection of our values. Do we prioritize the preservation of the natural world, or do we chase the boundless potential of technology? This question might seem theoretical, but with advances in technology, it could soon be very real. As philosophers, you're uniquely equipped to tackle these kinds of questions. What principles would guide your decision? Is it ethical to prioritize human innovation over ecological stability? These aren't easy questions, but they are crucial in shaping the future we're heading towards. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Would you choose the sweet simplicity of honey, representing the natural world, or the complex allure of the matrix, representing human ingenuity? Dive into the comments and let's discuss. Remember, every choice has its price, and every decision shapes our reality.